Hey there, I'm your host Lesawi, and in today's video, I'll show you how to create a zoom in and out for your character's camera. So let's begin. Open up your world and go to the content drawer. Inside, let's find our input actions. And here we're going to create two new input actions. Let's call it IA underscore zoom in. And the other, let's call zoom out. So IA underscore zoom out. We can save both of them. We can go back and let's go into our IMC. Inside here, I'm going to create a new mapping. I'm going to find my zoom in. And for none, I'm going to go to mouse and select a uh, mouse wheel down. Then let's add another mapping and I'm going to find my zoom out. And for this, I'm going to say mouse wheel up. Let's save this and exit. Then let's go and find our character. So for this tutorial, I'm using BP underscore third person character. For you, it might be Steve or Bob. Um, then from here, let's get our input actions. So IA underscore zoom in and my zoom out. Then we're going to get our camera boom and drag it into the graph. If you don't know what a camera boom is, it simply attaches your camera to your player. So from here, let's get this and let's get target arm length. Then I'm going to do plus 50 points. You can, of course, experiment with this. And um, depending on the value, it's going to go slower or faster. From here, I'm going to get a clamp float. And the minimum value is going to be 150. Once again, experiment with these values. And then I'm going to get my camera boom once again. And this time I'm going to set target arm length. And I'm going to connect this from the triggered. And for the zoom out, we're going to do exactly the same, but this time we're going to do minus. So we can copy this, paste it into here, connect it like so. Then let's get minus, so subtract and subtract 50 points. From here, I can copy paste the clamp. And then once again, let's get our target arm length. So I'm going to connect it like so. Don't forget to connect the camera boom. And once again, from triggered into here, and our code is looking good. So we can comment this code and call it zoom in slash out. Let's compile and save. And now if we test it, our player should be able to zoom in and out. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you liked it, leave a like. If you didn't like it, leave a dislike. And as always, happy developing.